everybody. Welcome to my channel. This is Loretta McCobb. And today I am going to do a haul video. It's a fr little, um, it's stuff from everywhere like Target and Walmart. No, I don't think Walmart, um, Dollar Tree, stuff like that. So, um, I'll tell you where it's from and I will get started on my video. Thanks guys for joining me. So, but the first thing I got, it was at the indoor flea market. And I got this for my room, and I thought she was beautiful. And I paid $4.97 for this beauty, and I just fell in love with it. I should have got the other one. There was two of them, and I think the other one had pink glitter eyes. So, But I love her because she had the bow. So I got that. Then at, um, let me see. Then at Dollar Tree, I got me a candle, and this is my favorite one. It's uh, the Air Fresh Tropical Breeze. I just love that candle. It smells so good. If you can pick this candle up, I recommend that you pick this candle up because it smells great. Then I got at Dollar Tree um, some calendars. I got this flower one. And then I got the sunset one. And it's the 2018. Both of them are 2018 and they're 12 months calendars. Okay, and then, um, let me see. Then at the um, indoor flea market, I found some Christmas things that were these. This one was a dollar. Then this one was 75 cents um, let me see what else then I found these glitter trees which were a dollar and then some more glitter trees that were a dollar what else then I found these cute little people for 75 cents and I love love the little snowman I thought he was so cute and then I found this one for 75 cents okay and then one more this one for 75 cents they have more um but I don't know if I'll go get more. They even have the little miniature houses and everything. And everything is 75 cents. So that booth was. And then I got these at Target. I thought these were really cute. And these were a dollar. Okay. And then at Target, um, I bought this exfoli exfoliating scrub, oil free. And it's deep clean. I've never tried this before, so <coughs> excuse me. I'm gonna try it. See if it works. I tried it on my hand, and it's it works really well. So I bought that for me. Hold on. Okay, we are back, and the next thing I bought at Target, I found this doll, and when I bought her, um, she was seven forty eight. Regular twenty four ninety nine, and um, I was just gonna use her like a regular doll, but um, she is Doctor uh, Fossier's daughter, so from um, Princess and the Frog. So I just love her even more, and her name is Freddy. So I thought she was so cool, and she's really pretty. And for seven forty eight, you can't go wrong. So I got her. Then, um, at Dollar Tree, I found this. I'm going to use it for my, um, door. Thought it was really cute. Okay, and we are back again. I keep getting interrupted. Sorry about that. Okay, and then for my bedroom... Let me see if this is it. Yeah. For my bedroom door, I found this at Dollar Tree. And I thought it was so beautiful. And it says, 
the witch is in so i am putting that on my bedroom door all year round i just love 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 halloween decorations and then for my front door of my house or i don't know if i'm gonna put that maybe the front door i got this one and it says broom parking i thought that was so different and i just love the glitter so i got that one got those two then um let's see then at target i got these 200 stickers and let me show you some of them how cute they are and then this one has the little candies so they're really bright and colorful and i paid a dollar for those so i got those from target then um i got some stuff at dollar tree like uh, i got these gauze pads then i got these big bandages then i got some more gauze then i finally finally found the alcohol pads so i got that one and then i got another one because i'm diabetic so these are going to come in really handy they're not that expensive at the store they're only like two dollars and change but hey if i can get them cheaper i'm gonna buy them cheaper so if you like have uh first aid kits and stuff like that these are good to have and they're perfect for what i need them for um let me see what else did i get then i bought at dollar tree some cute little pompons i thought these were pretty i don't have these colors they're like a darker probably like for the fall so i picked those up then i found these cute little googly eyes and i guess you know they're a halloween kind of decoration but i'm gonna use them probably in my crafting i thought they were really cute so i got those okay and then i found these two bandanas blue one and a red one so i picked those up i like them really cute I'll put these over there okay and then um I'm kicking myself now because I didn't get two of these, so I'm going to have to go back and get another one. This, it was closed uh, in shrink wrap, so I didn't get to see. You know, it shows the example here, but they are way prettier when you open them up. Look at those, how pretty. So, so cute. And now, now I'm thinking I should have gotten two. Look at that. It looks like Hubert's game. And um, you get uh, 30 sheets, so it's 10 of each design there's three designs so i just love them I'm, i just love neon I, I just love neon so much okay let me make a little room here and put these over here a little bit a little bit of room okay then at um dollar tree i picked up some more glitter and i don't know why i got more glitter i don't have this color i don't think this one in the bottom uh, but I have a whole drawer full of brand new glitters. And I told my husband I'm just greedy. But he said, no, it's uh, good always to have extra. So I agree with him. I'm not greedy. <laughs> and then um, I bought me some wet and wild mascara in very black. And this is new to my Dollar Tree. I never seen it there before. And then let me tell you a little story before I go on with my haul. Um, I was shopping, you know, and when I go to Dollar Tree, my basket always gets filled up because I buy laundry soap. I buy uh, sometimes paper towels and napkins and stuff like that. And that takes up a lot of room. And I always buy no more, no less than $80 worth of stuff. Well, anyway, I was at the cleaning stuff, picking out some stuff and um i turned the corner and that's where the food was so i was looking at the food and i bought a few snacks and stuff but those already put up anyway um there was a lady there and her son and um they were getting stuff to eat nachos i guess that day and the little boy she had picked out like two or three things and the little boy asked his mom can i have a can of olives and she went down and whispered to him that she didn't have enough money 
So I felt, oh my God, so bad. You know, my basket was full and everything. And I'm not saying I felt bad because I had the money or anything, but I know what it is like to go hungry and stuff. And um, I just went through a lot when I was younger. Uh, but anyway, it's this isn't about me. It's about this lady. So when I heard her say that, I got so sad because I knew the little boy wanted olives. And so I went into my purse and took out $10 and I... I turned around and I told her, here, take this $10 and you buy everything that you need. And she goes, no, no, I can't take it. She goes, I'm just uh, strapped for cash, you know, and stuff uh, because it's the end of the month and stuff. And I go, I know how it is. I know it is. I go, don't feel embarrassed. So she took the $10 and uh, when I was walking away, the little boy goes, can I go get my can of olives? And I was, oh my God, that made my heart feel so good. And then and then uh, he made me laugh, too, because I heard him tell his mom, can I get jalapenos, too? And so they went and got the jalapenos, and they got their olives and whatever else they needed. So I just kept shopping and stuff, and that was my little story that happened to me at Dollar Tree. And I just wanted to share it with you because I thought, um, I just thought it, it's, it touches my heart because I know how that feels when, you don't have enough. And I still go through that now, you know. We are a lot better off now, but, you know, and look at all the stuff I buy and everything. But sometimes there's times that, you know, at the end of the month where we're, like, strapped for cash and we eat whatever there is in the fridge, you know, leftovers and stuff like that just to make ends meet. But um, that's why I'm always looking for stuff, you know, at the Dollar Tree and bargains and stuff like that because I cannot afford to buy things um at full price so i just thought that's my little story for the day so i don't want to go too much into it so i'm going to finish my haul <laughs> so anyway i found this cute little door cover at dollar tree and these are little short they don't cover my whole door but i need to go get another one for because i decorate inside my house too so i need one for my kitchen door so I'm going to go get another one because they had a lot of cute little designs. So I'm going to go get another one because at um, Party City they have these as well. And they're like psh, five, six dollars just for one. So for a dollar and I end up taking it down and it gets torn and we end up throwing it away. So for a dollar, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> so I got that. And then I found this cute little doll dress at Dollar Tree. And I thought it was really pretty. They also had it in yellow, but the yellow wasn't that well made. I thought the white one was really cute. It's cheap, but I liked it. So I got this cute little um, doll dress. Then, uh, let me see what else I got. And then I got a makeup brush. And I thought these were so cute. It's wet and wild. And I've seen a lot of girls haul these, and I wanted one. And uh, my Dollar Tree never seems to get stuff until like way later sometimes. So I finally found one and I picked it up. I was so happy that I found that. Then I got me some Reach Dental Floss at Dollar Tree. I love this stuff. The mint, it's mint waxed. I just love the mint uh, kind. I always ask my dentist for some when I go and they always give me some, but I run out. Then I bought me some acetaminophen for pain. Uh, you know, my doctors give me other prescribed pain meds, but I don't like to take those too much because they make me feel groggy and stuff. So I just take this and that works for me. Then I found this Lip Smackers. It's really nice. And it's in um, pomegranate and lemonade. And I thought that was really nice and i've never tried this one before so i picked it up i got that then let's see then i got a curtain liner and i use this to cover um some of my doll stuff so it doesn't get dusty and i usually end up cutting it i don't use it in my home i just uh use it to cover up my doll like a dust cover kind of but i cut it to size so I can use this and cover several things at once. So I got that. And then I went into this um once in a while we go there. It's like a it's like a charity shop for orphans. So I found uh these two dolls. Uh the bag is marked 
Uh, if you can see it, it's marked for three dollars, but everything is half off. So I got them for two for a dollar fifty. So first I got her, and she needs a good cleaning. But I love her little fairy dress. So I got her, and then the other doll. I I I didn't even look at the other doll because I just wanted this one. But her, it's a, uh, it's um, Elsa, I believe. Yeah, Elsa. And she's got her crown. She's naked, though. But um, for $1.50, you can't go wrong. And she's in really good condition. Of course, she needs to be cleaned up. And I might, uh, since I have, like, two other of these Elsas, I might just remove all her factory paint and just make a whole different doll. So, yep. So it probably won't even be an Elsa. It'll probably just be a customized doll. So I got them. And then, let me see. Anything else? Oh, yeah. And then I found this um, makeup brush at my Dollar Tree, finally. Um, I think I had picked up one of those at one time, but it's already gone. And then the, I think this is the last thing I got. This ceramic painting set, and it's a little, it's a little vampire, but I don't know. I don't think I'm going to use these paints. I have a ton of acrylic paints, and I'm going to paint him in... He's going to go in my room because I love Halloween decorations and I love vampires. So, yeah, that's going to go in my vampire collection. And, oh, yeah, one more thing. I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. Okay, we went to the Halloween store and, oh, my God, I wanted everything in there. But um, I'm not going to really buy anything uh, till next month. Uh, from there because it's kind of expensive and uh, but I wanted this and this was uh, $4.99 and I had to have it and oh my god look at that it's hocus pocus and it says I'll put a spell on you and it's got the Sanderson sisters on it and they got some other um Sanderson sister stuff there that I am going to go pick up next month I hope hopefully they'll have it if not that's okay but I had to have this when I saw it. It is so awesome. I just love it. So yeah, that's my little haul, guys. And let me give you an overview. And let me know what your favorite thing or things were. Or what you found that was cool or um, different and stuff like that. And I just love that curette stuff. And it saves me a lot of money anyway. And I got that stuff. And that's it for my haul, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much for your comments. Thanks for subscribing. Um, if you can, if you want, please share my videos. I've been stuck at like uh, 547 for quite a while. I go up to 550. Then I subscribe to somebody. They unsubscribe. You know that song and dance that people do that aren't genuine. But... It's okay. Anyway, so if you can um, send some subscribers my way uh, so I can get up to my 800 sub giveaway. And if you're looking for that video, go look for it on my, my channel. And I might put the link in the description box. But anyway, um, I will see you guys later. Love you guys and be safe. Be kind. And always uh, try and brighten someone's day when you can. And I will see you later. And I love you guys. See ya. Bye-bye.